Hello there and welcome back to Cory Loses, where today we are finishing our Confederacy of Independent Systems playthrough in Empire War Expanded Fall of the Republic. In the last episode we had uh, that business on deck on Eomoidia, which was uh, not great, but we are down to the last few major Republic fleets. There are a few that are kind of roving throughout the galaxy. Uh, they have a couple A6s in some places, but we are pushing our way north. Uh, we do have uh, another fleet that is mostly ready here, so I'll probably grab them and move them down to Contram again. Grievous's forces are what we're focusing on. Focusing on. I don't know why I see it like that. Uh, we're going to send Grievous to Kuat, and then I think we're going to do Coruscant. So we're going to do Kuat and Coruscant. Uh, Kuat, Coruscant, Karita, all the hard uh, C sounds. I guess Kuat, hard K. Choose your reinforcements. All right, uh, we got Grey Rose of the Confederacy. We've got almost all turbo lasers. We've got Kraken, Unleash the Kraken. Invisible Hand's gonna go behind. Uh, we'll drop a support on each side. Show me your moves. Hydra Dominatus. Depredator of the Core. I feel like we only really need to focus one with each. I can actually send you up there. You for this one. Alright. So what happened to Count Dooku? Uh, Dooku had some accidents earlier on in the campaign. Dooku is no longer with us. And I should say, for those watching on YouTube, this is being recorded live on Twitch like the rest of the series. Um, I guess also, let me know what you guys have thought about that. Because uh, I think these are the two first ones that were entirely recorded on Twitch. Maybe the other, the last Fall of the Republic one was as well. But if you guys have a significant preference for recorded versus... Traditionally recorded with me offline versus streamed. It's like I try to answer the questions, but also like keep it as close to the offline recordings as I can. So like the the questions from chat uh, give me something extra to talk about, but don't hopefully distract too much from what's actually going on. If you feel like that hasn't been the case, then let me know and we'll see how to do it going forward. Because I, I always do want to have at least some stream series, and the community challenge is going to be like that as well. But uh, if it is detracting or if it's if it really changes the feel of the playthroughs, then I can also do offline recordings. We're on the move. I just don't want to get lonely. That's all it is. Weapons are. Target those lasers. Okay. We no longer have control of do it after they all show preservation protocols. Yes, command. We've pretty much wiped them out, all of them. We just gotta get up to the to the shipyard now. So there is that vendor, but it's just gonna come across a bunch of bulwarks. All right. Get on up there. All 
all units decommissioned immediately. Initial objective complete. Well aimed. Nice moving. Standing by. Yes, my lord. Ready. Targeting. Roger that. All right. I think that's actually the last vendor they get. Waiting orders. Moving ahead. Copy. I copy. So we just got to destroy the shipyard and then that vinegar. I'm surprised they haven't retreated because we don't actually have any interdiction mines out. Unless these are counted as interdiction or interdictors directly, which I don't think they are. But oh well. I am hoping to get not just the executor, but also the uh, at least one of the shipyard textures done. The executor for this inch playthrough, it's probably just going to be like the top, the trenches, and the uh, the cityscape, and then I'll be completing like the the casing around the engines and the yeah. Okay, so it's not counted as an interdictor. Uh, the engine casings and the hangar, the bottom hangar, uh, as I go through, but. Because, like, most of the time you only see the top. And for a preview playthrough, that's all you really need. I almost sent Grievous down there alone. No pretender can hope to defeat me. Construction complete. All right. All transport ships commence landing procedures. We got one of each thing, Katie Y. Um I sense your desperation. If you relent for a moment. We can get here. I don't think we can get up the hill without no causing problems. Can vanquish a Sith. A droid doesn't deserve to wield a lightsaber. Soon the Jedi Council will need a to select zone. a new member. Building under so construction. Yourself, General. There are still Order acknowledged. Of Jedi. This is a Complete. All right, we'll get some vision there. Oh, that's a lot of. Octoptars would be nice here, but. All right, let's actually send them over there. Ventress, get back here. And we'll get some repairs going on over here. Or some vision, rather. There might be the heavy vehicle, or advanced vehicle factory on this side. So often there's a building or two. Like we'll just go from here up the side of the mountain. One Sith apprentice is enough. What's coming in the next update? So the next update for Father Republic is going to be relatively small. Uh, a couple bug fixes. Uh, the main thing is going to be for lag reduction. So a lot of tactical lag reduction because of some changes to fighters. No gameplay changes, just shadow meshes that didn't need to be where they are um, primarily and field bases for ground because we we have a bunch of uh, much larger scale updates we're working on between both mods and we want to make sure that we can kind of do those together without having to wait a bunch to do a bunch of other Fall of the Republic content and stagger them like that uh, so it's unlikely that there will be any units it's not impossible, though, because there's some stuff that's, again, modeled. And, uh, oh, so this, actually, the 
The Providence then probably isn't going to be updated. The Acclimator might be. Uh, but yeah. So. UTAT might be coming because there's a model for that, not a texture yet. Uh, but yeah, the, the main thing is just the field bases and the bug fixes, general quality of life improvements. Because we do want to get into the bigger galactic level reworks that we're working on. Well, Ventress, go and get that. Yeah, we're doing a, a lot with uh, some changes to how the economy works, uh, reworking the era scripting in uh, in Thrawn's Revenge, and so there's a lot that's coming. That like Galactic is going to get a rework on a similar-ish scale to the tactical reworks the last couple versions have had. Uh, so. There's a lot to come there. We haven't really spoken too much about specifics in it yet because it's in very early phases with most development. But I am strong with the dark I am but a pawn in service of a greater power. Alright, uh you guys are doing everything you can, I'm sure, but A lot's going to be based around improving the flow of the game and making certain strategies less OP and feel less like they need to be done uh, to be playing effectively, like encouraging, uh, prioritizing different planets, changing how you build up different planets. Um, so rather than just rushing everything and especially hopefully doing something about the... Uh, one of my more common strategies of just leaving a, a space unit over a planet and having that win. Where are the... Oh shit. Just fucking keep going. Alright, slow down then, so you can die. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad you're dead. I didn't like you anyways. You weren't my favorite units that I still had. Where is the fight you promised? Now the disciple becomes the master. Bombing run available. The knowledge of the Jedi pales before the power of the Sith. I'm not sure where the other structure was. Or was was there an yeah there has to be an advance because that's where the juggernauts come from. Is it over here? Ready to destroy the clone. I can sense your No, don't worry about him. Okay, fine, worry about him a little bit. You are the best the Jedi had to offer. The order is doomed. Roger, Roger. Blast. My master has All right, now please you. capture this. And I guess we'll get a military field base as well. Okay, there it is. Here we go. Planetary control achieved. Beginning construction. Enemy fleet is about to invade Felucia.
All right, so they have a Praetor here. I think they have like three Praetors right now. Choose your reinforcements. All right, Rampager, I'm going to bring you in a little bit farther back. Autobot, I'm useful. Jar Jar's five-star die bar. Devil's Rage, Machine Over Man, Nothing of Value, and Sexy Sarlacc. All right, get in there and... Do your super thingy. All right, I guess if you want to turn around that way. And Ash, how's it going? All right, that didn't go how I'd planned because I was hoping to turn it around the other way. Yeah, we would have fucking re Yeah, whatever. That was a waste of everyone's time. Just yeah. Our target priority is the laser cannon. Stop it. Just shoot it. And this time The engines are our primary Because I know better. All right. Oh, I guess what I should also do, since the sound is gone, let's do Knights of the Old Republic 1 now. And sorry about that. There we go. Need to make sure we don't let it escape this time. Direct fire on the engines. Roger that. Engines. 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 See so if we can get more guns. From the subjugator to be able to focus it. So I think it was all firing, but just to be on the safe side. Oh, but like seriously, guys, engines, please. Could that be? Could that be a thing you guys do? That'd be epic. Here, you know what, Rampager, you're the only one I can trust apparently. Oh my God! I swear to God. Was I was I not clear enough in what I wanted to happen there? I'm pretty sure I targeted the engines with everyone like 30 times. <sighs> Such is life. I guess I need the interdictor for this then. It's happened twice now. <laughs> Y-A-W. Alright, let's make them pay at Coruscant for that. Four victories, six Venators, eleven Acclimators. Your reinforcements. All right. Grey Rose. Reinforcements on route. Kraken. Moving ahead. Almost a wall of turbo lasers. DH Omni on the back there. Grievous as well. Let's bring in some of the smaller ones. Charlie's baby daddy. There's no sauce here. I regret my decisions. Magnificent Munificent to Regular Munificence, Critical Whiff, and Providence. Alpha 
That probably did so much damage to this. The lasers are nope, we're good. Target those lasers. I mean, it, it did do a lot of damage to it, but... Not as much as it's going to do. So there's one vendor mostly down, and victory mostly down, a second victory mostly down, second vendor mostly down. All right, let's send in SD of Mega Road and Ketsia. Now this victory and that victory all right keep going in and I'm gonna basically try to get to to gray rose Get it some support. Oh yeah, as of recording, this is the uh, the 15 year anniversary of uh, Revenge of the Sith. So this is the Battle of Coruscant 15 years after the Battle of Coruscant in Rots, as Maldos is pointing out. Good show. Our target priority is the laser copy. Firing. Reporting. Open fire. How thematic. This one's gonna end differently. Waiting orders. This one's gonna be a CIS victory. I don't think we've lost anything yet. I mean, with the Lucra Hulk battleship doing all the tanking for us, we've been. In good shape. Alright, let's go destroy that. gonna lose the, the shields on Kraken here. The VSD is nearly dead. There's still three Venators. Okay, bombers need to go clean that up. And I'm gonna start moving some of our frigates farther forward. All right. Let's see if we can get Kraken forward there. The Kraken. That Venator has no engines, so it sh much like this now has no engines. So it should be able to uh, to be easily caught there. Here, see if you can get that one. A couple more passes from the bombers and the shipyard will be down. Guys go forward. 
lasers are our target. Yes, Target in sight. Target those lasers. The lasers are our target. Awaiting orders. Initiating attack. Our target priority is the laser cannons. Attack! Standing by. Alright. It's most of the vendors gone. It's all the vendors pretty much gone. Now this one's actually almost full health, so here we go. There's a dreadnought that's still making its way through here. There we go. And I think this is a garrison force, so I'm not. Even if we don't get the engines on this one, I don't think it'll matter. Yeah, just two dreadnoughts get away. Very different from the Battle of Coruscant 15 years ago. We did lose him in Ificent, so that, that is unfortunate. Are the bulwarks manned by an organic crew and or droid? I mean, for the CIS, there's droids pretty much everywhere, but you'd probably have like a, you'd generally have a organic command staff. Enemy base shields. I am eager to demonstrate my skills, master. Choose your reinforcement. All right, this would have been how or a good place to have HMPs. We've secured a build pad. A really good place to have HMPs, really, but. Construction complete. You look tired, old man. I will not fail my master. I don't know what the A6 situation is here, though. Oh god. Really wish I had HMPs. Yeah, let's let's come back when we have HMPs. So we need to be able to do something more easily about that artillery. Lost some of the uh, thingies. Magna Optiptars. Okay, we did complete the bulwark research, though. So this fleet of Grievouses is now in parked mode. It is now Voss parked. Take an axis. Let's take an axis with our allies. And support base. So there's going to be a lot of infantry, which means hellfires. And Droidicus. Ah. Oh god damn it. Another PR disaster for Asajj Ventress. Speaking of an axis, what do you think of the last Clone Wars episodes? I enjoyed them. Uh, me and Eck actually did uh, a whole Top Calf episode on the final season. So people should listen to our podcast, Top Calf Transmissions, which I almost never plug on this channel. 
so I really should plug it more. Unfortunately, Grievous isn't actually here. We still have hailfires. Not to worry, we are still flying half a hailfire. I think that's the quote. We've lost a pad. Hey, nice. roger, roger. Our base is under attack. Uh, you know what? Let's get over here. Them. Octotars there. Oh, we didn't actually lose those octotars then. I thought I only saw one in the fleet out or in the ground forces afterwards. Try to do your job, and you've disappointed me greatly. Do 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 do. I copy. Gold Squadron commencing attack. All right, let's go up the main street with these guys. Uh, we can send both of our AAT heroes. Probably need a bit more to make them pop cap efficient. You do only get the one, so... Maybe making them spawn a couple other ones so that it's them that actually counts for surviving. Because right now I tend to avoid using them just because they're not... Uh, a full company. You get one pop cap for just the... Or, you get one AAT for a full pop cap. Like, they're good for the command bonuses, but just... The trade-off there... Isn't necessarily... Or, isn't clearly better. Alright, we're coming down the road. Alright, now everyone can go. Yep. Alright. Into the rest of their base. Is that a clone? It is. Got him. But we did lose Ventress. System control Beginning construction. Will the killing never stop? Roger, roger. All right. Uh, Pathfinder, you can fulfill your job. We're going to send you up to Corson, I guess. Do an Ingo. You're going to get your first...
fleet actions there. Tactical battle imminent. Oh look, 11 A6s in space. The best place to fight them. Oh my god. Reinforcements are Battle carriers over here. EDF dreadnoughts. Fire blossom. Regular guys. Here we go. Ah, no, 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 no. Realize there's nothing I can do to stop you. But I could be very disappointed in you as you leave. Okay, well. I don't think it matters all that much at this point, to be honest. Got the Agamar fleet. It's two players. Alright, uh, let's send Rampager up there. Rider, rider. Tactical battle. That's just that. I mean, we've pretty much got all their stuff cornered. Formulating countermeasures. System lost. Public has conquered Felucia. That's not good. What I'm thinking is we'll take this fleet out. Uh, then we will take Coruscant on the ground. And then we'll go against that uh, two Praetor fleet. Because they have the two kind of lines of planets, but we've already got them uh, conquered in space for a lot of them. The lasers are our target. Direct fire on the engines. Destroy the engines. Uh -oh, up. You're shooting at fighters? I think you're shooting at fighters, and I don't like that. I'm going to stop telling you what to do. You're just going to stay still. Alright, get these little guys. Torpedo launchers must be destroyed. 
I really want this Venator to die. And it's very much not. There we go. Now it's very close to dying. So is this Acclimator. Alright. You know what? I'll just, just shoot at that until it's dead. Mr. Crisper! There. Now I feel better. Um, no, we can't kill the engines on that one. Oh well. Alright, they're going to sit there, and we just got 90% on them, so, oh wait, there's the two, or there's one in that one. Is this mostly ground units? Yeah, it is. You can't go back into the core. I've already won the core. Alright, they have their capitals. They don't have they don't have a heavy vehicle factory. The main thing I'm worried about is that uh artillery. Heading out. Order acknowledged. The fight's not over. At maximum unit capacity. We've secured a build pad. Securing area. Moving. Alright, can I get over to the artillery without exploding? Done. That's the main question. Right away. I think we can. I think we're making it. Okay, now let's get over to this other landing pad. All right, destroy these for being anachronistic. Do I want to bring in Greep? No, not yet. He doesn't have an AOE anti-infantry ability, so. So get in there. I think that's all steep. No, oh, we can make it. We can come out this side. Alright, I guess we'll kill the tax collection agencies first. I'm not as concerned about them, to be honest, but it's right here. You know what? I screw that. Kill the barracks, because we can actually kill the barracks. These guys can start getting out of the, the spawn point. Where's their capital? I want to bomb this 
Senate or the Senator's office? I guess it's got to be back here then. I have a question. What do you keys you click to move or you see? So, uh, the way I do it is I have this setting turned on. It's a keyboard? No, it's not a keyboard. Game options. Both mouse buttons rotate. So you go into options and you turn that on, and then you click both mouse buttons. Both mouse buttons, not mouth buttons. Then it rotates. Oh, we killed an ATTE off screen. Here, can this die? No. All right, just get the bug out of there then. Oh, cause we can get the we can get the power gens actually. So this is this is even better. All right, Grievous and Droidicas. There we go. What are you doing? A little bit farther than I wanted. But you're probably fine. Alright, Grievous. Alright, now this one. Let's get up there. Oh, Grievous, okay, Grievous, just do whatever you want. This is probably your last battle, so. Here, just get out of there. Grievous' worst nightmare. A small bike. Okay, there we go. to heal Grievous now. Uh, Senator's office. And Senate. We have destroyed the Republic's government. That actually lasted longer than I thought it would. Pair. Construction complete. Destination. 
Alright, we need to we need to get our support base. So we're about to start the final assault on the uh, on the actual base. And we need Oh, we can just get that vision. I wish we get this one's here. I always think we've removed it. All right, kill the bike. Leave no bikes alive. All right, we've actually got them pretty undefended up there. I think this will kill both of the. Mm. No, it's not worth it. Gold Squadron commencing attack. How come Dawn of War gets three games, but Empire at War only gets one? I mean, I think Empire at War in general is, uh, we got more out of it than any individual Dawn of War game. So I'm okay with that trade. Star Wars is a lot more open with its IP than Dawn of War is. Uh, what's the best thing to nuke here? There's not really anything that's the best thing to nuke here anymore. Why not? So I think these are victory relevant. We've secured a yes, Commander. Commencing bombing run. We've lost a build path. The fight's not over. Scanning vehicles. Choose your reinforcements. Give me just a few seconds. Distance calculated. Capacity. What the? I hate clones. This calls for a celebration. Is this a joke? Ah, okay, you didn't make it. Everything must die. Probably shouldn't have let the HMP die like that. No! You fools! You survived! I think these are the last ones. The final clones to die in this playthrough. Maybe. Okay, Grievous is taking forever.
These clones are very wily. We've secured a build pad. Do not have any chance to escape. All right. System conquered. That's the last ground battle. Roger, roger. They're trying to get into Humberine, I think. Or nope, they're just going through. Where did that Praetor go? Orinda? Okay. We've killed most of their stuff. We're just looking for one final Praetor. Get it boxed in. I want to do it with this fleet. I guess there's the one that's over our planet, but... We're all the way over here, so. Do we have our Pathfinder? You're a Pathfinder now. This is it. Alright, final appearance of the Golan 2 as well. Okay, Grey Rose. Fix a flat. You've been missing from our lives for a while. Almost a wall of turbo lasers. Depredator of the core. Uh, Trenches Pike. I regret my decisions. Hydra. Proud Immunalinst, RZ, Kraken, can I, th oh, there you go, there's just Duaningos everywhere. Uh, let's see, A-Striker maybe, or Dua, it's in right at the end. Alright, I guess the Golans first. Clear him out a little bit. Give us some more visual space. And, uh, yeah. In we go. The primary target is the engine. Frigate reporting. Attack that target. What else we got? Uh, Fire Blossom. There's no Dana Only Zool, I think that one was. There's no Saucy, rather. Regret is dying. No Sauce is dying. There's no retreat this time, Helmsman. The final Republic foe to die. I'm gonna get past it just so we can destroy the station as well.
Fire Blossom, dead. All right. So I guess as this Praetor takes its uh, its last hits here, I hope you guys have enjoyed this playthrough. I guess uh, it was our first look at the uh, the field bases, which again she'll be coming to Fall of the Republic very soon. Uh, we want to have a pretty quick turnaround on that release. It's a very fairly simple change. Uh, it won't even require like fully rebuilding the mod or I'll just port over some of the fighter model changes, some of the uh, other probably text changes and uh, and the field bases. So hopefully not too long after this episode goes up, you guys will have it. But I'll do a video uh, when it does happen so that everyone's aware of what's going on. But I hope you have enjoyed this playthrough. I'm not sure what our next Fall of the Republic playthrough is going to look like. I'm probably going to try to wait until there's a couple more uh, models in at least. And we'll figure out what we're doing there. But it technically the community challenge is going to be like a Fall of the Republic playthrough. So there will be a lot of Clone Wars. I'm not even sure what to call that that mod because it's going to be fall of the republic versus tr i guess uh but yeah so definitely been one of my favorite fall of the republic playthroughs to do this time uh probably the next dedicated fall of the republic playthrough we do will probably be republic uh and get back and forth on that when you're doing the community challenge that's going to be starting on may 31st uh, yeah, I think May 31st. Whatever the Sunday is, I think that's May 31st. But those will be streamed live on YouTube is the plan currently. Uh, maybe there will be some offline episodes, but uh, it's going to be entirely streamed on YouTube. But, uh, but yeah. So, again, hope you guys have enjoyed. And hope you guys are enjoying Fall of the Republic. I think we've had... Yeah, there was one other one that we did that was fully out well or like the playthrough started after the first release so uh not your first times but maybe even two anyways thanks again for watching everyone and uh hope to see you in the next playthroughs have a good night don't even need to save